classics, you know? I like the classics. I'm just make a butterfly mug to match this one. Yeah, I'm worried about the butterfly being too thin, though. These are my worries. These are my worries. Mango. I love mango. I'm on board with mango. Get the red. Oh, my red looks so dried out. I hope we can re moisten it. It's looking rough. What if you did it flat on the side of the mug, like spread it on its wings? Yeah, I did that with the beetle. Well, maybe I'll have to do that. Did that do that with the beetle monk? That's that might just be what I, what I have to do. Um, what a best female Dino mug streamer three years in a row. I haven't been <laughs> I've been streaming three years, but hello Ferguson, how's it going? I hope you're having a good day. Oh yeah, rehydrate this red. Um, and I, I don't know how much, I, I'm in a very niche <laughs> place. I don't even like chocolate ice cream, but I still like it. <laughs> yeah, I'm with you on that. Except with mint chocolate chip. I can't, I can't get on board with that. Um, even still, though, I think it would be, I, I would worry general if it would break still. Okay, I've got to be right back again. Sorry, I'm, I don't know. I have no sense of time, so I feel like I just left. But I need to leave again. But maybe it's been longer than I think it has been. I don't know what time it is. So you're telling me if that's the only ice cream available, you're not going to eat it. I might eat it. <laughs> Ah, you're right, yeah. Yeah, but it's... I wouldn't... You know what I wouldn't eat, though? Tiger, tiger. I would not. I'm adamant on that. No. It's a big no for me. I'll be, I'll be right back. I'll be right back again.
I'm back with another smoothie. Thank you, Scrooper. I'm sorry, this caterpillar's taking a while. And I don't... Oh, we were rehydrating the red. Blue is just screaming at me out there. I get no respect. Get no respect, man. Ass off. What do I got? I just can't yell that. You relax now, that's good. Me too. Except blue's making me anxious. <laughs> she makes me feel like a bad mother when I'm just trying my best out here. You trained the cat. Cats, you're wrong, General, because cats can't be trained. Cats train us. Cats just meow all the fucking time. That's what works. I love cats. I'm just saying they train us. Are you kidding me? I love cats. I love them. I would die for a cat. Cats are actually the ones in charge because they live in life of luxury. They do. They really do. Blue really lives the life here. She knows how to live. Beautiful fates today. Um, uh, they're also pretty easy to satisfy. Yeah. Uh, Alkaline X, thank you so much for the raid. Thank you for being here. Really appreciate it. Uh, Blue is just very food driven. So she's hungry all the time. Um, welcome in everybody, enjoy the sunshine. She's sneezing out there. Oh, I love a blue sneeze. Stressful, so successful stream. I'm glad, that's great to hear. Um, yeah, go to sleep. You take care of yourself. Streaming's... Streaming can be exhausting. Go make sure you're taking care of yourself. But thank you so much for the raid and bringing your community over here. I really appreciate that. Just be doing one mug tonight. I don't know what the body of the mug is gonna look like.
one special cat alert. What do you guys think birds are saying? Maybe the cats are just communicating to the birds. Blue communicates with the birds. She does that chattery thing. I feel like there's life happening outside. I sense a lot of noise. Life happening. I love people watching. I'm not a huge fan of people talking, but I like people watching. It's a fun thing to do. I think that's what I do at parties when I'm invited to parties. I just kind of like stand there and people watch. <laughs> Which is kind of, I don't know, I don't mind it actually. People are interesting. Mm. There's a lot of noises outside that I don't know what they are though. What's going on out there? There's not enough fields just to lay in by my house. Like there's one, but it's kind of too open. Laying in a field is good. I don't even know what I'm talking about. <laughs> just trying to just, just feel the silence. Me and a friend went to a bar a little bit stoned one night, but otherwise sober and watched people. Kind of realized that the whole thing was one massive bird mating ritual. <laughs> is that what it is? I can't go to places high. I cannot. I went to a 7-Eleven once to get a Slurpee, and my, I can't. I can't explain that story because I'm going to be embarrassed if I talk about it. I can't. The whole... Uh, it's very stressful for me. <laughs> I can't relive it. I cannot. I could be... I wish I was better. I, I just can't. Public people... I don't know. I'm just... I'm very paranoid about it. Have to talk, I just have to sit at home and talk to Blue. Watch true crime documentaries. Uh, what ice cream did you say you didn't? Tiger Tiger. Yes, that is, an, it's awful. It's awful. I'm surprised that ice cream flavor still exists. The mind, it boggles. I couldn't find it. Oh, Tiger Tail? It's probably the same as Tiger Tail. But I thought it was called Tiger Tiger. Um, 
But maybe it's called Tiger Tail. It's like that Berenstein Bears thing. Uh, it's, yeah, it's called Tiger Tail. It's the worst ice cream. And I'm offended that it exists. <laughs> yeah, it's called Tiger Tail. I'm sorry, I got it wrong. Um, yeah, it's, that's not a good ice cream. It's orange and black licorice. It might not look bad, but it sounds horrible, doesn't it? Think about that. Think about it. Oh. It's like a toothpaste and orange juice ice cream. It's just, it's not, uh, I don't know. Uh, I don't like black licorice, I do not. I hate it. I hate black licorice. Why would I want something that's salty and has a weird taste the way black licorice does? I don't like it. I'm one of the three people that like, really? I'm disappointed in you. I talked to the Facebook group and we are going to take legal action. Dang. I wonder if I liked that ice cream because I love licorice. You can try it and let me, you know, report back to me. That's something my dad would eat since it has black licorice in it. I don't know, man. I, oh. I'm in Poland. Yeah, I, I don't understand it. But you know what? I can respect it, I guess. But I don't understand it. It's like those cinnamon heart things. What the hell are those? That's not candy. I do like salted caramel ice cream, hell yeah. You don't have that brand? Maybe you can make your own get delivered. I don't know how easy it is to get ice cream delivered from a different country, though. Tiger ice cream is an acquired taste like wine or Nicolas Cage. I don't like wine either. And I'm still not on board with Nicolas Cage. <laughs> still not on board. Uh, because people used to call me Nicholas Page in high school. <laughs> and I don't know, I just... I'm not convinced. I'm just not convinced about Nicholas Cage. <laughs> or what character he's playing all the time. I don't know who that is. I don't know who that is, the character that he is. He doesn't seem like a real person. Kind of like a train wreck. Ah. It's like that show, The Room, or Room? No, maybe it's The Room. Have you all seen The Room? Let me get it. Let me get up. Let me link it. The Room is the movie. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> with the same sex scene twice, <laughs> and it's somehow more awkward the second time. But they just reuse the sex scene in it, oh my god. That movie is, it's, it's, yeah, it's something, it's something else. Oh, I don't know if it's the worst movie ever. Let me give it a good, quick Google search here. Worst movie ever. Oh, what are the top 10 worst movies? The Twilight Saga. Batman and Robin. Catwoman, Spider-Man 3, Last Airbender. 
Super Mario Bros, Battlefield Earth, Jack and Jill. Uh, Son of the Mask, Transformers, Revenge of the Fallen. This is what Google's given me. There's also an American comedy called The Worst Movie Ever. Or wait, I don't know if that's true. Forget I said that. How's the room not on here? Maybe it's just like so bad that <gasps> Mac and Me is in it. This is from, I think, Rotten Tomatoes. And the number one worst movie is Ballistic X versus Sever. One Missed Call. Has anybody seen One Missed Call? I watched that when it first came out. A Thousand Words with Eddie Murphy. Super Babies, Baby Geniuses too. Yeah, you can just tell that that was going to be a bad one. National Lampoon's Gold Diggers. Jaws, The Revenge. Mac and Me is definitely on here, but Mac and Me should be in the top 10 best movies. <laughs> in my opinion. Maybe The Room isn't on here because it's not considered a movie. I don't really understand what The Room was. <laughs> uh, we'll kill the dinosaurs, the Ice Age. Trolls 2? Did you, did you enjoy high school or was it trauma? High school was garbage. But I mean... I don't know, high school was garbage. <laughs> you can play a character who plays raw and tamed natural talent. Interesting. Sex scene first thing because he had the hots for the female lead. So awkward. I feel embarrassed for, I just felt embarrassed the whole time watching that movie. There's a dinosaur Transformers. $1,000, it's opening night. Really? That's, that's pretty good. Chaz, hello! How's it going? What did I say? Did you, when, when did you enter? I don't know, we've been saying a lot of stuff. <laughs> I, I don't know if I can clarify any of it. Mm. I want to add some blue to, to this. My heart. I went away. I went away. Do I have a light blue? I have, oh shit. I have a medium. A medium blue. You need to go into the room with the intention of laughing at it the whole time. You don't take it seriously. Yeah, I think every, yeah, everybody. It's definitely a movie, well, I did watch it with people, but I think we fast forwarded some of it, but what a masterpiece. I'm trying to think of a movie that I just absolutely hated um, and was like, just what a waste of time, but I can't, I can't think of one right now and on the top of my brain. I didn't see the Twilights, because, well, why would I? <laughs> okay. High school musical? I remember in elementary school, is that when people were into high school musical? Everyone I was friends with liked that shit, and I was like, why? This is awful. What even is this? 
I don't understand. Why? I think it was a specific group of people that that watched whatever that was. I've only watched reviews of the movie because I watch movie reviews. For some reason. Okay. I blew go. I did not see Twilights. Apparently the books are really good, right? Has anybody read the books? Are the movies good though? Are they? Maybe they were good. I don't know. Uh, was the Lego movie good? Because I started it and stopped it within minutes. I did not give it a chance. <laughs> If you start a movie with singing, I'm like 90% not interested in a movie that starts with singing. Somebody's singing to me. Plot wise, not good. Production, 100%. Oh, because when it first came out, people were like telling me it was amazing. It was such a good movie and then I needed to watch it and then I watched it and they were singing to me and I was like, it's too much. <laughs> I feel attacked. Uh, hello, Tootie Moon. You've been... <laughs> Did you watch all of Observe? How are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. Uh, is that how you spell idiots? Yeah, it's a musical. It's hard for me to like a musical. It's very hard for me to like a musical. Okay, I like Willy Wonka. But you guys already know I hate the song Cheer Up Charlie. I, I'll always fast forward through it. Or even when that girl sings about how obnoxious she is. Okay, we get it. You're obnoxious. <laughs> it's annoying. I've watched all the ones I could bear, the YouTube drama ones. Ooh, yikes. <laughs> uh, what are some of the movies you loved? I like uh, The Truman Show. It was a really good movie for me. Uh, I just loved anything Jim Carrey, really. Um, and I was really, really into Will Smith. I was like, Will Smith. Um, I like Seven Pounds, I used to say, is one of my favorite movies, but I don't know if it still is. Uh, the Green Mile, I used to say, is one of my favorite movies, which it's still in the top. I love The Green Mile. The Majestic. I don't know if I've seen The Majestic. Um, oh, I think I have, yeah. It must have been a long time ago because I don't remember it all that well. Yeah, seven pounds is good. It's a tough one. Gives with communism and gets amnesia. Yeah, I remember now. He like drives into a river. Uh, Pursuit of Happiness was good. Yeah, the Green Mile is really good. I'm trying to think of if there's anything else. I should really make a list because I really like Shawshank Redemption. That's a good movie. Mm. 
Goodwill Hunting. Hey, Nerms, how's it going? Happy Friday. Hope you're having a good day. How you doing? How you been? How are you? Hope you're doing well. Hope you're doing well. Mm -hmm. Trying to think of another movie. I really liked Castaway until my mom's boyfriend from prison watched it like every single day, like three times. And now I don't think I could watch Castaway. I've had enough. Just listening to Tom Hanks like grunt every like five minutes. Not interested. I don't, I don't think I've seen Concussion yet. We plays a doctor studying brain trauma is amazing. That's concussion, I think, right? Blue, do you want to say hi to your friends? Or do you just want to yell at me? What are you doing? have a superpower it'd be the one from Green Mile. Really? I don't know that's that's a rough one. Pretty pretty it was pretty bad. I could have a superpower. Two Stephen King movies on the list as it should be. <laughs> um, I also really liked Storm of a Century which is another Stephen King movie. Hey, Blue, do you want to say hi to all your friends? Let's see, come up here. Coming in here. Eat my cardboard. Um, which I don't think anybody's heard about. Blue, say hi. Just a little bit over and then look at the camera. Okay, see you later. That's all you guys get. That's it. Okay, love you. See ya. Um, it's really convincing Nigerian. I mean, he wasn't convincing, which isn't like him. Take away people's pain and turn it into bees. Yeah, but he gets sick. And then if you can't take away people's pain, it, it uh... It's horrible, and it eats you up inside. The bees, they get stuck in there. Poor little John Coffey. Sounds rough. Like a rough time. And then nobody believes him. Okay, we're getting close. I know it's 6.30, Jesus. I still want to play a few songs. I learned a new song I wanted to play. Um, have you seen The Notebook? Um... The notebook about again. I'd love it. I did see. Oh, I don't like the Ryans. I don't know. I'm not convinced about those guys either. It's about Alzheimer's? The notebook? I thought. No, I don't know. <laughs> I. Ryan. If they get old and the lady forgets him. Oh. That's rough. See, that's why I keep a journal. So I'm worried about forgetting stuff. Because I already do. I think 
that's revealed early in the movie. Uh, I do like Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind. I love that movie. Um, what about TV shows? Give me some TV shows. I still think about Chernobyl. That TV show was insane. And now I know the kind of place that Homer Simpson works. It's dangerous. It's spooky. Hannibal. I think I s star. Is that the TV show? I must have started because I love. Um, I'm. I don't know if I should say love. I'm fascinated by things with cannibalism in it. Kind of interesting. Um, there was I actually listened to this true crime uh, story about these people that were cannibals. And they, they had a whole recipe book and stuff. And when the cops found them, their like whole fridge was like full of like pickled ears and shit. And that's why I have an age restriction on my channel. If I talk about cannibalism, who knows what I'm going to say. Uh, I haven't seen Mr. Robot. I've heard so many good things about it. I think Summer watched... Mr. Robot seems complex. It seems, it also seems like a big commitment. <laughs> I haven't seen Better Call Saul, but I've seen Breaking Bad. Um, yeah, I like the first season of Westworld. I haven't seen Westworld. Maybe I'm not good at, I haven't seen a lot of, I really like Kidding with Jim Carrey in it. I'm waiting for a new, new season. I love that show. Um, I'm gonna add eyes and then maybe a little bit of shading. It's taking so long. Um, and then maybe we can do the. Only two episodes I didn't love. I did watch, I think it's called You, where there's a stalker guy. Maybe I gotta rewatch that. I'm still watching Lost, so I can't really get into like, it's my brain can only handle so much. Um. It was good. I like creepy shows. I still haven't finished watching Upload. Like, I feel like it's been so long that I just... I don't even remember what happened, so like, what's the point? <laughs> The Serpent. The Serpent. Is it a TV show? Mm. Uh, oh, is it about... No. She caught and imprisoned. Oh, it's got a 7.7. .7. I really care about reviews on IMDb. <laughs> Must be like a 7 and up and I'll watch it. And I know I'm, that's picky, I should not judge by reviews, but I do. And it's just the way that I am. S society. 
Um, I do love Mads Mick, Mick, Mitchelson, though. Drugged and murdered back Packers and Kylan in the 60s. Dang. Just when I think I've heard about all of the people that... All the weird, crazy murders, there's always more. It's insane. Nine and up is sus. What movies are nine and up? Are there movies that are nine and up? I haven't seen a nine. Avatar? The TV show? We're watching that right now. I hate wasting my life on bad movies. Yeah, me too. Except comedies, I feel like, can be kind of hit or miss on IMDb. Like, a comedy that I like sometimes... Yeah, because everybody has different, um... Opinions on what's funny, I think. Because I particularly loved ha uh, House Bunny, is that what it's called? Anna Ferris, and it has horrible reviews. <laughs> But I was like, what? I thought this movie was fucking hilarious. <laughs> Some other comedy that I like. Oh, I want to watch I Love You, Man again. Oh man, I just kind of want to watch comedies now. I am always afraid of watching new comedies because I feel like there's no good new comedies. <laughs> Oh, thank. Thank you, Subsolos. I hope you have a good night and a good weekend, and I appreciate you. And yeah, thanks for hanging out. I really love having you. Um, what a good comedy. I can't even think of things right now. Get hard is good. Get hard. Oh, I've heard of that one. Sorry, you guys probably can't see shit all over the place here. It's just hard when I'm doing stuff this detailed. I just, I need, I need to be over here doing it. Nothing against you guys, it's just it's the way it is. Things will never change. Show up your you man is so underrated. <laughs> yeah. Uh would it be difficult watching Pineapple Express at this point? Difficult. What do you mean difficult? Cause we were talking about how Shitty James Franco is? Because James Franco is shitty? Yeah. It's tough. I wish people just weren't shit. <laughs> that would just be a lot easier for everybody. And I, I just love every everything with smiley face. I think I did watch it, maybe. I, re I know what the cover looks like. And I love Anna Faris. But I don't, I'm pr I probably watched it. But I don't remember if it was good or not. She's like a stoner. It is funny. I do love Anna Ferris. I just she has 
she has it, you know? Whatever it is, she's got it. Also watch anything with Paul Rudd in it. Which reminds me, there was a show he was in called Living With Myself that I loved, and I wonder if it's coming out with a new season soon. But I fucking love Paul Rudd, man. I love him. Anna Ferris is great. Pronounce her name right, though. You should know by now that I don't pronounce things right. I thought that's how her name was pronounced. Did you watch The Queen's Gambit? I did, I did. I loved that show. That show is very good. We're not, Tootie Moon. We're not. Nobody even brought up a jork. Nobody. I don't know, but Bjork is it auto modded in here. <laughs> I don't think it is. I think Bjork is. We're never going to stop talking about Bajork. My VIP powers aren't enough to utter their name. Bjork. Yeah. Yeah, I should probably find out who... You don't know who Bjork is, Judy Moon? We talk about Bjork all the time in here. <laughs> Apparently I look like her. And it's weird. Uh, she's helped produce a lot of music. That's been, uh, what was that song she helped write? Uh... Um, I thought it was a Weezer song, but maybe I don't know. That's gonna bother me. I thought for sure there was a Weezer song. Maybe not. Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know, Tootie Moon. People think people. We should almost have a counter for how many times people come in here saying I look like Bjork. Cause it's all I all I hear. <laughs> it's crazy. Um, she's over fifty now. Yeah, people. People get old. All right. Uh, The word is on and we uh, a command. They're serious, Two D Moon. They're serious. I'm pretty sure they're people that like they'll first come in here. They'll be like, "Has anybody told you that you look Bjork like Bjork, like Anna Ferris?" 
Alright. Um, I think the caterpillar is done. Now I'm going to consult my spreadsheet. Oh, see, Aqua even did it. I don't even remember who said that I look like Bjork. But many people have. Um, what are the colors I need? Uh, luster. Oh, no. 40 iron luster and oatmeal. Let's see, I don't see it either. But, uh, I don't know. <laughs> um, iron luster. And oatmeal. Okay. I think I'm learning how on iron luster, to be honest. Ooh, I'm going to use my new brush. Hell yeah. Might be a little big for some of the areas, but... I'm in the before times when uttering her name wasn't banished in Pageland. <laughs> yeah, the before times. Yeah, I don't... Stephen is slamming around. Slamming. Okay, we need... It's 641. We're doing good time here. I did not think well I had a feeling all of these all of these would take a little while. Ooh, really? I love a no mortal orchestra. going on out there? What the hell's going on out there? Uh, yeah. Go to self, what Bjork is banned? Start using Bjork. <laughs> yeah. This guy, what's he doing? What's this guy up to? <laughs> what's he doing over there? Slamming. Go out there and say, hey, Slammy. Is he chopping wood? What's he doing? <laughs> oh. Too small now. Okay, so let's see. I have like 20 minutes until music times. Yeah, I'm gonna finish this mug and then well, however long that takes. Between 7 and 7.30 will be music times. That's all right with all of you. Judy Moon. Pew pew. Do you guys hear that banging? Do you hear it? I do. <laughs> I'm hearing it. Them ceiling squirrels. Probably stay seated then. Oh, do you want to go for a walk? 
Or maybe I will try standing. Who knows? Keeping us on our toes. Now, well, I guess we do have raccoons here, but I haven't seen one. Apparently, Calgary has raccoons, though. Raccoons are super cute, but honestly, super terrifying. Super terrifying. Um, but I've had people in my real life tell me I look like Bjork as well. Before I, I was on Twitch actually. So, I should always look like Bjork, I guess. Oh no, I did all my blocking. It's my back. So try and exercise and stretch and rest. Yeah, make sure you're getting what you need. Hello, Wolfie Luna. How are you doing today? Happy Friday. Hope you're having a good day. I was sitting on the back deck a few nights ago and a little fluffy skunk walked up to me. Aww. Skunks are cute, huh? I think skunks are cute. I have to put six layers of glaze on this. Is he chopping wood out there? I mean, prairie dogs are pretty cute too, yeah. Tempted to pet him at the same time. That's where they get you. I love the nature. I think this mug's gonna look cute. A baby skunk? That sounds adorable. I don't think we have skunks just hanging around. I think they're like out in the country or something. I don't know. I haven't seen any inner city. Uh, what are you getting, Wolfie? No problem, no problem. I I use bad grammar all the time. I, I don't apologize. <laughs> Just remind, reminded because they said the back, yeah. No, no, skink. What's a skink? Um, an axolot. Oh, wait. You're getting an axolot? I don't know how to say. Those things are friggin' cute. What do they eat? What do you, how do you take care of them? That's exciting. What are you going to name him? Or her. Axel, I don't know how to say axolot. Or is it just axolot? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce anything. That's a, just obvious. Axe. 
a lot though. I wasn't sure if you pronounce it the L or not. Oh, you know what? I was gonna put... That doesn't matter. I need a new banding wheel, because this one's ridiculous. The, just the fact alone that it's like uneven, is it just boggles my mind. And it's from a ceramic place. It's like... You have two jobs, for this thing to rotate and for it to be level. The third layer? Yeah, third layer. Bloodworms and her, her water temp is a pain, but it's pretty easy. You look cute. That's exciting. I've never seen one of those. Well, maybe I have, but I, if I did, I, I don't remember. A skunk carrying a sink. Hello, Kate. How's it going? How are you doing? It's been a while. How are you? Hope you're doing well. Is the third layer? I think so. But we won't know because I... It's hard keeping track. Axolotl. Alright. Let me do white on the inside. I've never seen a bear. Well, actually, I've seen a bear at the zoo. And I don't know if I want to pet a bear more than I want to hug one. Got a new job about to start doing some real estate-ish work for, with a friend. Well, that sounds, that sounds great. That's great news. Taking names. More of the same. Sorry, I gotta, I gotta do this over here. And there's really just not a lot of room over there. Just don't mind me. Don't mind me. Leaving it. Oh wow, I really dipped it in there. It's nice seeing you though, Kate. Thanks for popping in. I appreciate it. Appreciate you coming in. Hello. Um, yeah, I don't know how to hug human beings and animals. It's a lot. It's more my speed. You know? I think this mug is gonna look cute. It's a really little one, but it's kind of really adorable. I got some clay. Well, you can make anything. Just try squishing it around for a while. And maybe you'll think of something. Okay, you can make anything. Set your mind to. Um, bonus trash panda. I love a trash panda. Sorry, I'm running out of fucking room over here. 